Hi, I'm Sean Francis. I used to make a video on this channel every single day. You might have noticed that lately I haven't been. Oh, beautiful for heroes prove in this parading stride. Who more than self our country loved in mercy more than life. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. You know, I feel lazy, and I'm sure some of you think I'm lazy too. So, here's my story. In the summer of 2016, I just quit pole vault. Instead of using my master's degree, I decided, hey, I'm gonna buy a bunch of camera gear because I really like making videos and I like helping people. So I thought I could combine the two and start making videos for people who needed help. So I bought all this camera gear and I was confident enough that I think I could probably figure out how to use it, but I didn't quite know how to use it all yet. Maybe not the smartest choice. So because I didn't know how to use it, I challenged myself to make a video for every day of September to learn how to use it. After September ended, I just kept going. And I just kept going to the point where I made a video almost every day up until June. It kind of worked. You know, I, I learned how to use a lot of the gear. It helped me learn how to tell better stories. I learned about sound and I learned about light. Oh, and I bought a drone. And if you don't have a drone, I highly recommend you get one. Good times, good times. There's gonna be good times, good times. And the more videos I made, the more I realized I had three different audiences. I had the Sean Francis vlog people. I had the pole vault people. And I had the mental health people. And don't get me wrong, there was some overlap in a lot of these too. I want to thank everyone who's right dab in the middle who likes everything I do. I split the channel into three. The pole vault channel, we talked everything pole vault. And, you know, the occasional fart joke. Hit the subscribe button. Good things will happen too. Confetti might shoot out of my butt. Because fart jokes are funny. And I don't care how old you are, this will always be funny. And we split the mental health channel because splitting the pole vault channel was successful. With the idea of talking about advances and new ideas in the mental health world. And sharing tools that have helped me as somebody who's been dealt the depression card and someone who's helped others with the depression card. I just want to give people a new perspective on the mental health game. And we've done all sorts of things so far. Last week we talked about Chester Bennington of Lincoln Park committing suicide. Why do you think Chester is selfish and weak? One of the answers I got was, I have kids of my own and I would never make my kids feel that way. Ever. And then I just responded, I totally get that. When, I, when I'm in a depressed storm, I feel weak too. I also start to think that everyone around me would be better off if I just wasn't around. That I am causing more harm in people's lives than I am creating any type of good. And when my mind frame is warped and distorted like that, ending my life is more of an honorable thing than a selfish thing because I'm protecting the people I love. Making their lives better by not having me in it. And that's the disease of depression right there. That's what happens. We talk about 13 reasons why and if it was good for people with mental illness or if it was bad for people with mental illness. And my favorite video I've done on that channel so far is I did a whole vlog on psychedelic drugs and how they have helped people with mental health disorders. And then we have my favorite channel. This one. My favorite of them all that I will love unconditionally until the day I am no longer here. Now the better I became at making videos and telling stories, the more opportunities started popping up. And the more opportunities I explored, the less time I had in the day to make videos. And the less videos I made, the more frustrated I got because I wasn't making videos. My beautiful little chameleon of a channel. It's been so many different things over the years, including the original home of the pole vault vlogs, the original home of the mental health uh, videos I started making. In the past few weeks, it's been a vlog. It's been a channel to help promote my buddy building a school bus to live in for a year while he travels the country trying to bring awareness to this public lands fiasco going on. And it's been a place where I can share stories that I find really interesting, like my buddy Riley being a US Javelin champion and why he continues to do it even after Tommy John's arm damn near falling off. It's still a personal therapy channel too. I, I'm not gonna try and hide that. But what now? What color will this chameleon morph into next? I don't know yet. 
And that's where I need your help. I need your feedback. But here's an idea. I'm going to make at least three videos a week. One on the mental health channel, one on the pole vault channel, and one on this channel. And if I have more time, I'll obviously put more on here. But I don't want to over promise and then under... On, you, you know what I'm trying to I can't think of the word. But that still doesn't answer the question of what this channel is going to become. What do you think it should be? I'd love for this channel to be a combination of a vlog channel, my perspective on life, and interacting with the world from somebody with my unique situation. Kind of like a personal journal of my own. I'd also like this to be a channel where I share stories. Stories of businesses or companies who are making a big impact in the world and kind of shaking things up. And finally, I'd like this channel just to continue to be what it's always been. A place to experiment and grow and try to figure out what the fuck I'm doing. Good times, good times. Guys, let me know what you think. If you have any other ideas, I'd love to hear them. Life is meant to be experienced and curiosity will get you there. If you guys haven't checked out my other channels, you should check them out. See you next week or sooner.